Hello everyone, my name is David Richard from Weekly Tool. Welcome back to our channel, where we provide you with valuable automotive tips and tutorials. Today, we'll be tackling a common issue that many drivers face, the dreaded P001 for code. If you've ever seen this code pop up on your dashboard, don't worry, we're here to help you diagnose and fix it. Before we dive in, make sure to subscribe to our channel and hit that notification bell so you never miss our expert automotive content. Understanding the P001 for code. Let's start by understanding what the P001 for code actually means. This code is related to your vehicle's variable valve timing system and indicates that there's an issue with the exhaust camshaft position. Symptoms of a P001 for code. Before you can fix the problem, you need to know what to look for. Here are some common symptoms that might accompany the P001 for code. Rough idling. Poor engine performance. Reduced fuel efficiency. Stalling at low speeds. Diagnosing the problem. Now, let's get into diagnosing the issue. You'll need an OBDI scanner to read the code and gather some data. We'll walk you through the steps to identify the problem. Use your OBDI scanner to retrieve the P001 for code, check for any other related codes, inspect the camshaft position sensor and its wiring, examine the camshaft phaser for any signs of wear or damage. Fixing the P001 for code. Once you've diagnosed the issue, it's time to fix it. Here are some common solutions. Camshaft position actuator solenoid replacement. This is often the culprit. We'll show you how to locate and replace it. Oil change. Sometimes, sludge or dirty oil can affect the variable valve timing system. We'll discuss the importance of regular oil changes, timing chain or belt inspection. If your vehicle has a timing chain or belt, it might need replacement if it's stretched or damaged. Before we dive into the step-by-step -step repair tutorial, it's crucial to discuss safety precautions. Whenever you're working on your vehicle, prioritize safety above all else. Here are some key safety tips to keep in mind. Safety gear. Wear appropriate safety gear such as gloves and safety glasses to protect yourself from any potential hazards. Disconnect battery. Before working on any electrical components or sensors, disconnect the vehicle's battery to avoid electrical shocks. Parking. Ensure your vehicle is parked on a level surface with the parking brake engaged. Use wheel chocks to prevent any accidental movement. Proper tools. Use the right tools for the job. Having the correct tools not only makes the job easier but also safer. Follow repair manual. Always consult your vehicle's repair manual or an online resource for specific instructions related to your make and model. Congratulations! You've successfully fixed the P001 for code in your vehicle. Remember that proper maintenance and routine oil changes can go a long way in preventing such issues in the future. If you encounter any difficulties during the repair or if the code persists, it's wise to consult a professional mechanic. We hope this comprehensive guide has been helpful to you. If you have any questions or if there's a specific automotive topic you'd like us to cover in future videos, please leave a comment below. Don't forget to like this video, share it with your friends, and subscribe to our channel for more valuable automotive content. Thanks for tuning into Weekly Tools and happy driving.